This is like kind of being in a maze when you're a kid. Right? When you're a kid, you can't see over. As an adult, you can see over. So, as you can see, you got the lines going through the entire house. Feed pattern, very, very, very nice, very smooth. So, again, very versatile. You could stucco this, you could leave it. Our plan for this is we really want to embrace what it is. This is a 3D printed house, and we want people to see this as a 3D printed house. So, the design lends itself to a 3D printed house. We're gonna be spraying on paint. It's gonna be a very, very subtle light gray, and then we're gonna have nice warm accents throughout the house. A lot of wood, wood flooring, wood accents, wood shutters, just to kind of warm up the space again, because concrete isn't exactly the, uh, the warmest feeling. So, these are the doorways, right? As you can see, there's a rounded edge when the machine's making the turn. For the doorways, after we put it through, right before it gets hard, we take a grinder, and we go down top to bottom to flatten it out. This way, it's much easier to install the doors. Otherwise, you have this rounded edge right here, which is virtually impossible to try to fit a door opening. So we grind it down like so, pop the door in, and we're good to go. That's why they are so innovative when it comes to their 3D printed construction technologies. And I bet the content they're willing to show us now is only a fraction of what they're capable of make sure to subscribe to my channel to follow up on all the exciting developments happening in this technology in the future.